field trips, anywhere else in the world, they're going to zoos and other fantastic places. We went to Polaris. My name is Garrett Hedlund, and this is my north. I live just outside Rosa, Minnesota, which is the home of Polaris and the Broughton Brothers. My father worked at Polaris, my mom worked at Polaris, my brother worked at Polaris, and when I was growing up, my dream was to work on the assembly line at Polaris. Our farm consisted of like a thousand acres of farming land. We had like 20,000 turkeys, 200 head of cattle. I was born with chores. Our school was about 75 yards long. It had a little outdoor ice rink with a warming house at a local in the town would room with a little irrigation tank that he made. That was his personal Zamboni. So we were so far out that we were the first ones on the bus and the last ones off. I did a canned food drive play. This role was a bully and I had to wear a bandana. That was the first time I'd ever acted in, in my life. And then I walk into church on Sunday and then this lady's like, yeah, I really enjoyed you in that play on Saturday. <laughs> you get a little starstruck when you're on the farm. The local newscaster from Grand Forks, his name was Too Tall Tom Shemansky. And if I could have met him, that would have been it for me. The next thing that everybody looked forward to was the Rose Oak County Fair. We had to pick out a yearling, and then you have six months to sort of beef it up, groom it, teach it how to be led, and ultimately make it become your best friend. But try not to be too attached because, you know. So yeah, I brought a steer to the fair. Him and I became such good friends that I would fall asleep on top of them. So in the local newspaper, they took a picture of me and they said, while well, everybody else is hard at work, look at little Garrett Headland sleeping on the steer. You get to visit these wonderful places and travel around and stuff like that. And after a little bit, you're just like, man, I just want that peace and quiet again. And it'd be nice to just go home for a little while.